another barge crash guys look at this this is in oklahoma granted it's a smaller bridge it's also a smaller boat but nonetheless another one and right within close you know time with the, the last one so they they did shut down the bridge but the bridge didn't collapse so that's good someone actually saw it and recorded it uh again always a little sus when someone records it right how did you know to record it you know a bridge near the carry lock and dam in Salisaw, Oklahoma was shut down on Saturday after it was struck by a barge. Uh, this is out of the Oklahoma Highway Patrol. They responded to Sequoia County after a barge hit a bridge near the Kerlock and Dam. Uh, let's see. US 59. This is out of Oklahoma Highway Patrol. This is the US 59 South in Salisaw in Kerr Reservoir is currently shut down at the time due to a barge that struck the bridge. Troopers are diverting traffic away from the area. The bridge is going to be shut down until inspections of the bridge can be made. Oh, so it's, it's, it's shut down still. They didn't collapse, but they got to they gotta check the concrete, make sure there's no cracks, make sure it's still holding up. Engineers reportedly inspected the bridge and reopened it for travel later on Saturday. Okay, so it is, it is back open then. A shocked bystander who captured the collision on video dialed 911 to report the an the accident here it is right here holy hell that's the wreck holy shit did you feel it yeah oh my god that no. part is loose one more time holy shit did you feel it yeah so uh, obviously not as big as a container ship, probably why it's withstood it. But um, yeah, uh, lots of things wrong with that one out in Baltimore, by the way. Uh, yeah, the one in Baltimore right here. First of all, there were there was no protective barrier around it, which is odd because this is the third busiest port in the entire country. We actually, when we were deep diving this over on Kick, we did find that there was this bridge was insured. Okay, so uh, there's a there's a possibility that um they wanted this bridge destroyed to build an even taller bigger one to fit even bigger ships through it okay uh obviously they can just simply uh discuss it put it put it to a vote and hopefully get it passed but uh all that bureaucracy takes a lot of time i mean if, i believe vegas is taking five years just to bring powerball into their state but this here, just imagine this, okay? There's two tunnels and a bridge. The tunnels don't allow hazardous materials, which means the bridge, if that bridge is shut down to be dismantled and rebuilt for a new one, the port could probably sue the city for loss of revenue, right? So um, these are things that, as to why, hey, maybe it's probably, probably just better to destroy it, huh? And put it on the insurance company. So um, that's a possibility. The other possibility could be that, uh, oh, uh, uh, Netanyahu's mad at us because we... Uh, did not vote to veto the ceasefire bill in uh, the UN, right? So um, they're mad at us and they did this as, as retaliation. 